Okay, here is an exercise for you to do. Exercise 1. We have to find the coordinates of the midpoint of the line during the points x1 and y1 and x2 and y2 given by that formula. So there's the formula for you to go by. And here's the first uh, exercise for you to have a go at. Right now, there it is there. Right, so just pause the video now and see if you get those five correct. I'll give you the answers to those and then I'll follow the answers up with the solutions. Okay, now here are the answers. The first one was one and a half, one and a half. This next one was a over two, minus a over two. The next one was a plus b over 2, a plus b over 2. Next one was minus a half and 3 on 2. And the last one, the more complicated type, was 3ct over 4 and 3c over 2t. Okay, now here is the, um, the solution to these. First one, you add these two together, that's 0 plus 3 over 2, and then 3, this one, and this one, 3 plus 0 over 2, and of course that gave you 3 on 2, which is 1 and a half, and 3 on 2, which again is 1 and a half. You leave it as 3 on 2 and 3 on 2, that's all right. Next one, that was naught plus a over 2, naught plus a on 2, then minus a plus naught over 2, and it gave the answer, of course, a on 2 and minus a over 2. Okay, this one, a fairly easy one, it's going to be a plus b a plus b on 2 and b plus a or a plus b on 2. Okay, this one here. Now minus 3 plus 2 over 2. Minus 3 plus 2 over 2. And 7 plus nearly 4 over 2. And that gave the result of minus 1 over 2 or minus a half. And this is 7 and minus 4 is 3 on 2. This one a bit harder. This is going to be CT plus CT on 2 all over 2. And this one will be C on T plus 2C on T all over 2. Now this is 3CT on 2. 3C t over 2 over 2 and this one is going to be 3c over t it's a common denominator over 2 now this will become when you invert and multiply 3ct over 4 and this one of course becomes 3c over 2t just be careful with these ones 